So we're playing Subnautica. My name is Water. Uh, this is a, a sight unseen playthrough. I haven't looked up anything online. I haven't done any research about what's in the game, what monsters are in the game, which areas are in the game. The only information that I have about the game at all is from viewers who let me know about certain things or will give me advice or you know chime in with like here's a good idea um so yeah today we are going to finally make ourselves a radiation suit we have got the plans we have got the required equipment we're going to make it we're going to go out and we're going to see what there is to see off in that great blue yonder or yeah, the ship that's just basically over there um having said that let us um uh, start afresh and get going
Welcome aboard, Captain.
restored. All primary systems online. Okay, now? What the hell? I don't know. That was really weird. <sighs> okay. You can hear clearly now. Um, yeah, I don't know. Weird stuff. Weird stuff keeps happening. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let me just change my loadout, so that'll be the first one. Uh, your bot got mad at me for yelling the word Subnautica in all caps. Bad bot. Bad night bot. Bad night bot. Over sensitive night bot. Not good. Don't be like that. Um, okay, scanner, three, four, five. Okay, so I did save. I did save. I don't know why it decided to um, mute, but, you know? So yeah, now I was saying that I did a whole bunch of research. Um, uh, but ocean life. That sort of thing. Um. And I'm interested to see what I make of the game now that I've done a little bit of research about the kind of thing I should be seeing. I'm not picking up all the salvage because that's not why I'm here. Ah. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. <laughs> nope. I do not. Hang on, let me look at one thing at a time. Open supply crate. Oh, that pick up battery. Okay. Is this another supply crate? Oh no. It's a Cyclops fragment. Two out of three ain't bad. Okay, so I've got the full... I've got the full... Um, radiation suit, finally. Um, the other things that I've done is I built the... I built the... more of the habitat. I... 
Um, oh. Ah! Fuck! Jesus. <laughs> Whoa! No, 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 no. God, God's damn. What the fuck was that? Thirty seconds. So you didn't miss that. What the hell? Oh, what what the what the fuck is that? I don't like it at all. What the verily hell? Ah! Reaper Leviathan? No, 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 no. Yasus. Okay. Wow, that was that was deeply uncomfortable. Holy fuck. <laughs> Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Uh, yeah, well, the, 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 the fucking... No, 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 fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. <laughs> Die, go away, Jesus. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. We call him Samu. <laughs> Dear God, what the fuck was that? Oh, Sammy, you call him Sammy. What the hell? Uh, indigenous life forms, fauna. Leviathans? No, that's a reef back. Carnivores. Um, I do not think that's a herbivore. I do not think that's a herbivore at all. Thank you. Damn. What's that in the distance? <clears throat> Yowzer. Just hold a live peeper in your hand and let him swim up to you. He'll eat it and leave you alone for a bit if you're brave enough. Um. Maybe after I've... Uh... Maybe after I've researched stuff? What is all of this stuff? And why can't I scan any of it? Okay, let me just get back to my sea moth.
before anything else attacks me, because if I die, now I'm gonna die. Okay. So I've made, I finally made my um, Sea Moth. I made my um, mobile vehicle bay. I've done a little bit of building here. Um, and I have built a lot of stuff indoors. Okay. Okay. Phew. Non-functional laboratory equipment. Okay. Um. <laughs> Wait, do I not have salt deposits? Oh, I got picked up cords, not salt. No. Oh, okay. I will try the, the trick with the peeper. Um, uh, yeesh. Okay. Phew. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Adrenaline. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna have to go make myself some more tea because I'm out in real life. Yeesh. Okay, that's gonna haunt my nightmares. So basically I've got 24 hours to contain the... Um... To contain the... Um... What was I going to say? To <laughs> lost my train of thought entirely. Uh, to contain the radiation from the ship. But now I'm wondering... If I don't, what happens? As in like... If I don't stop the machine from exp I'm, 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 I suppose exploding. Uh, or the ship from exploding, or the radiation from causing permanent damage, basically. I don't know what the effects of that would be in the game. You, Sephiroth, Sephiroth says he obviously didn't know about the people thing for a long time. He had played the game several times before realizing that. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, the game doesn't really tell you much, does it? I mean, it does kind of uh, leave you to explore. So I did a bunch of exploring. Uh, before the session, uh, in terms of like the history of diving and diving equipment and free diving and diving bells and all kinds of things, um, which has been really interesting actually. I didn't realize how far back free diving actually went. It's like, I think it's 4,000 years BC. So, free diving is a widespread means of gathering and hunting 
uh, both for food and other resources like pearls and coral dates from before five, 4500 BCE. I mean, that is like, that's intense. Um, so free diving, uh, breath holding diving or skin diving is a form of underwater diving that relies on breath holding until resurfacing rather than the use of breathing apparatus like scuba gear. I am really glad that we got to play this game with scuba gear. I don't know if I would want to deal with everything and um, and a limited amount of uh, breathing because I don't think it like swimming f f away from something very very quickly is probably um, yeah it's uh, I, I can't imagine that it does much for your uh, your oxygen supply I mean I'm, I'm breathing quite heavily and I'm sitting and I'm not having to expend any resources to move at all I mean I'm basically just, like moving my hands and feet but that's, that's not Um, right, okay, so, I don't know what it wants me to do with this, um, I don't know what it wants me to do with the... Sample analyzer. I suppose I can try and fix it. Let me just get my repair tool, which I've left where? Uh, why is it in there? No. Oh. One, two, three. Ah, there we go. No, that's the habitat builder. You don't need the habitat builder. You've got the repair tool on you anyway. Mod ass. Um, oh, you can't drop it, so... It's a decoration item, that's all. Ah! Ah, well. Let's make titanium, at least. We have scrap. And there's nothing new or exciting we can build. Uh, Pathfinder tool. We've got Pathfinder. We've got a Pathfinder tool, don't we? Not that we use it very often. Where did it go, actually? And now I built one. Oh, I do want to upgrade it, though. I think I've got enough stuff to upgrade things. Uh, one gold. And then... Five. And one... Where did I put the silver? Oh, I don't have any cop. I don't have any gold or silver anymore. Whoops. Whoopsie! Okay, that's fine. Um, so I'm just gonna put this away. Ugh, I don't know if I want to venture out there again. <laughs> uh, that was terrifying. I don't like. Did not enjoy it at all. Thank you. Okay. Probably, actually, I probably need more. Um, probably need more of those, don't I?
Right. Okay. Because now, for the life of me, I can't remember how to just pick up or grab a... What the... What is that? Oh, it's just the, the top of the creek vine. My friend, don't scare me no more. I know that there are bigger things in the sea. <laughs> okay, so I'll need to figure out how to find a way onto this ship. Preferably with art. Letting this fucking beastie know that I'm here. Okay. I don't like this, I don't like this, I don't like this at all. Nope. Do not. Uh. Yeah, no. I don't like this one bit. Do not like it. Give me vertigo. How is this giving me vertigo? Um, do not like this at all. Do not like it.
Okay, how do I get on this thing? Okay, I already got that. Let me just search for it anyway. Energy full, okay. Power transmitter. Hey. New blueprint acquired. Okay. Okay. Energy full. Fine. Haven't I just gone around, all the way around the ship now? Yeesh. Okay. Let's see, is this the way in? Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Holy shit. Oh, I don't like this. What now? Warning, ship's structural integrity is low. Fire suppression equipment and laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. Okay, so now I need a fire extinguisher. Okay. Sure. Whoa, okay. Damn.
And I don't have a beacon here, do I? No, I don't. Decreased. Okay. So apparently, no light passes more than a thousand, a thousand meters in the actual seabed. Not seabed, in the actual ocean. Uh, Ish. I think I picked the wrong difficulty setting, honestly. Oh wow, okay, I'm just getting further and further away from this damn thing. Oh! What the actual no? I don't like it. I don't like this at all. Stop it. Make it go away. Ah. Uh. 
this is seriously like it's gone from it's gone from oh this is a cool place to explore to like fucking alien isolation I'm telling you Yikes. I think I may just give this ship up as a lost cause, honestly. I'm just gonna keep pulling where I am, thanks. Can you take the... I suppose the question I still need to ask is, can I take the seed moth um, to the to the wreckage, or um, is this basically like it? I didn't even get attacked that time, but like, damn, that was, that, I don't like it. I do not like it at all. Nope. No, 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 no. Do not like it. Howard. Yes. Absolutely. So fire extinguisher, yes. Habitat Boulder, I'm gonna see if I can make another um What do I need for more solar panels? Oh okay. Power transmitter extends the range of a power source. Okay. Okay. Titanium quartz. Okay, so gold quartz. Copper ore. Okay.
game, another parcels. Um. I can't remember now, actually. Um. So, I wanted to ask, can I send the sea, can I go and explore this in the sea moth, or can I use the one of the cameras to go and explore and find out at least where I'm supposed to be going? I'm just trying to save time. And then otherwise, I mean, I suppose that's a spoiler, but like, what happens if I just don't do anything? Like, I just don't go look. I don't go look what's there. I don't try and solve the issue with the uh, um, with the radiation causing destruction to the. Um... Alright, no, 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 come around here. I'm here for the. The cameras are a safe way to scout out things. If you do nothing, nothing will happen to go in more advance. Okay. Because it did say, it was like, you've got 24 hours to do this thing, and I'm like, ah, panic. Um, okay, let me see how much it would take to make another fire extinguisher. I've got enough of that. Okay, great. That's charged, that's charged, that's charged, okay. I can just keep doing that. I don't know how many times I can do it though. Ah. Oh. Do I have a camera left? I think I might have a camera in the box of equipment. Camera drone. Camera drone. 
Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. I must learn how to use this compass properly. Okay. So yeah, I was looking, like I said, I was doing a bit of research because I've been meaning to and uh, kind of uh, forgetting, let's say, to actually get around to doing any of the research. Um, and obviously I realized that I knew some of this stuff already, but uh, first sort of diving like actual piece of diving equipment is sort of the diving bell. I didn't know that there were a bunch of types. Like there was several, there are several types of um, Which call it several types of diving bells. Of course, I can't remember what they are now. There was one that was like, like a rescue bell. One's a wet one. The other one is. Um, there's a closed bell, there's a wet bell, and there's a rescue bell. But diving bells were used as early as the 4th century BCE. I did not know that. I did not know that at all. So people have been playing crazy bastards with the sea for a very long time. Um. I uh, do not know if I would have been one of those people. I'm actually full already. Okay. Okay, trash can! Woohoo! Maybe I can make a trash can out of this. New blueprints. I've got new blueprints. Acquired. Um. Um. Oh, and I didn't bring any water. That was silly. Okay. So I'm gonna get a little bit closer. I'm gonna use this the second of the
Okay, so that's where that is. I don't really want to get stuck here without any water. Okay. So I'm going to go back and we'll see what's happening over there. In the meantime, I have been thinking of doing like a... Um, like a version of story time for this, which is kind of like, um, well, I still have Nautica, so like reading out some cool things I've found about like underwater, like exploration and kind of things people got up to. Or I might just sort of blather it out at random intervals just because I know it or because I've looked it up. Um, Honestly, I haven't really thought of it too much. Okay, so the repair tool, where's the repair tool? Okay. Okay. Consume. Okay, I'm almost out of water again. Oh, okay, it's another one of those things. Okay, fine. All my waterproof lockers. Uh, didn't want to leave them lying around in the field, as it were. Okay, let's see. too far away what's happening miscellaneous I can make a trash can permanently deconstruct unwanted items and safely release the constituent atoms into the atmosphere huh okay sign okay I'm going to make a trash compactor for all my 
Um, unnecessary stuff that I don't need anymore. Yay, deconstruction. Because I don't need those lockers. I really, really don't. Like, I can do this, come on. Hit with it. There we go. Ah! Okay. I'm just going to take this thing out and put it over there. I mean, I've got a radiation suit. I've got radiation gloves. I kind of want to throw those in the... I kind of want to dump those in there as well, actually. Radiation suit, radiation suit, yeah. Radiation gloves. I suppose a lot of these things can also go, actually. Don't really need them. Um Yeah! Throwing stuff away that you don't need anymore, that's nice. Been wanting to do that for a while. No. No. Jeez. Okay. Right. What else can I make? Oh, a captain's chair. Relaxing in confidence building. So let's go grab some titanium and make some chairs. Why not? Okay. Um, I might just take a break to uh, have a little bit of dinner. Uh, but I'll be back. Won't take too long, I don't think. Okay. I really do need to figure out how to build uh, some... How to add some windows to this place, because I want to sit down and have a nice look at things. Hey, thank you. So, am I doing something wrong with the cameras, by the way? Because I don't know... Is, are they too far away for me to control them? Do I need to build some extensions? Because I don't know what...
I don't know if I'm missing something. Okay, I do need to go find some more sea salt and some more coral. So, um, basically I would, I used to be able to move the cameras around, like, oh, I want to go exploring this area, so then you click on that, uh, kind of, um, you click on the monitor, uh, you start basically just, like, moving it around, like, as if you're driving them, yeah. Um, and for some reason, I just can't seem to drive it anymore. Well, I mean, the ones I just put down have got full battery power since because I just basically changed their batteries. Well, relatively recently. Uh, relatively recently before, like, dropping them off. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong or if I've missed something. I don't know, it's weird. <clears throat> I can't understand it. So yeah, I basically just don't know why it's not letting me do the thing. But let me... Sorry, little fishy. You're about to get your goose cooked. Um, yeah, there we go. Yeah, I can go back and explore some more, I think.
Bird brain. Whoa. Okay. Not sure I've seen this before. No, I have. Don't I? I hate those things so much. Almost died for not looking at where I was going. Not, not, not. No. Or not checking on my oxygen supply. That's why I almost died. So apparently a lot of quartz in this area. Drop it. Back ass. Okay, let's get moving. Oof. some peeper and have some peeper for dinner. Mm. Okay, I can make copper. I'm gonna make a beacon just so I can take the beacon back to the other ship if I need to. So yeah, this is...
But I think that it looks like a connection is missing. No, this is not my actual hair color, uh, uh, but it, it the hat does make me feel like I'm Steve Zizu, or at least in a one of the uh, at least one of the extras in the Life Aquatic. Um, But sadly, no. Cook paper. I'll have some cooked paper in the meantime. I'll also have some water because. Apparently, exploiting the ocean is a thirsty job. Deposit. Hey, we can make more water. Oh, so you were asking earlier about what else I've done. I've explored the island. I went to the. Was it the sun? The auroras? I think it was the auroras? Or the sun? Something or other had a uh, sent me a, a call to tell me a sunbeam. That's that's the one. So I went there. Um, yeah, so I went to the sunbeam. I saw that whole installation. I went up and down the elevator a couple of times. Uh, serious, uh, serious case of. Uh, vertigo both times um, up and down and then I sort of briefly explored the idea of swimming out through that bottom pool and then went nope nope no 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 um, pretty much and uh, yeah so that happened that was uh, that was a thing um, Also, uh, yeah, not not too not too fond of that one. I have been on the island, yes. Um, it, I, hmm, let me think. So, yeah, I've been to the island. I saw the installation. I managed to get my way, find my way inside, explore it a little bit. So now I know that. There's some sort of infection that they've been trying to... That someone at some point decided to try and contain. I don't know who else is still here. I've also had an apparition appear to me and ask me, Who am I? Uh, and then disappear. Um, yeah, I think that was... That's been it so far and then I just sort of added, ended up building some things here. Um. Okay. Okay. So 
Right, well. Um. Yeah, it's been... It's definitely been a uh, welcome aboard, Captain. Um, a very interesting experience. Okay, so the wreck is east of the ship. Sunk to the ocean bed. Yeah, no, I don't know if I can get to any of those places yet, really. to the thing we wanted to go check out. Nuclear waste disposal. some water. Be my ship alone, you bastard. Is that that's not the repair thing, is it? That is the repair tool. Okay. What's that? I haven't seen that before. What the? Oh, it's 135 feet. I should get up.
Whoa. Okay. Damn. The biomass in this area is dominated by plant life. Picking up faint or terror vehicle signatures. Oh, okay. No, no, no. Don't like, don't like, don't like. Mushroom forest. Yeah, I don't like those, the number of those big beasties over there. Not at all. Like, not at all. Are they, are they like ships and things that you can find that is going to let you go deeper without, you know, Oh, okay. Huh? Interesting. Um, okay, so basically, are there... Are, do, can you build ships eventually that let you go further... Further down? Black part 4. Okay, so yes, you can also upgrade existing craft to go deeper. Okay. That's good to know. Because yes, I don't think I'm going to enjoy this whole business of going further down that much. At least not until I've got uh, some better idea of um, I suppose just like what the dangers actually are. Oof. Okay, so... Yeah, because I don't think free diving is really the way I want to go <laughs> um, with this game, if I can avoid it at 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 all, like on any level.
Right. Free diving deeper would be impossible without additional support craft. Yeah. I mean, I know that there is the... I know that you can, in the game at least, use the little uh, the water pump with the uh, was it the, the the wires and things, not the wires, the the, the copper the, the the pipes. No, you can't do that in this game. And I know that the free diving, like IRL, uh, also does things like that with, um, you know, like support, support, not 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 so much staff, but like equipment along the way. Lights on and off. Mm -hmm. Of course you can. Creature decoy attracts creatures to its location, can be deployed by hand or by submarine, cannot be reclaimed once deployed. That is fine by me. Yeah, it's the pipes, the titanium pipes and the floating air pump I was thinking of. Equipment, what was the... What was the laser cutter? I don't have any diamonds. I do have the propulsion cannon though, I haven't used that yet. Hmm. Welcome aboard, Captain. Consume. What do I need for a wiring, kids? I keep forgetting. Silver ore, I don't have any silver ore. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go to the... Use more than one.
How exactly am I need to manage to make a second one of those in the first place? I can't even remember. Um, okay. So, right, okay. Mm Okay, let's go hunting for silver. I do not need more titanium. And I've got two cupboards full. I could probably build out another room with lead or something. Okay, I thought it was getting night there, I was just confused. You have two of these. No, I just freaking drop it. Oh, my God. Uh, oh, there we go. really help me so I have to go back so I still need to find some some iron iron and silver
Inventory full. Ish. I regret not taking an easier difficulty on this game. I really do. I mean things I need to make any of the things I want to make. Ooh. So I can see the I can see through the one camera. I, I can see through two of the cameras but I can't actually activate them. Wowzer, okay. Use vehicle bay. Cyclops. One person see in space vehicle. Space vehicle.
Okay, yeah. Into the sea now. Okay, hang on. Yeah, camera drone charge 100%. I don't understand why it's not... Why it's not letting me travel... Or search anything. How far can you dive? Okay. Okay, I might get myself killed now. I might get myself killed, but I'm gonna go investigate over there. I find it less frightening than that. Goddamn. Um. Although, now I'm traveling into. Uh, those guys' territory. Which again is not really filling me with a great deal of uh, uh, confidence. Or do I want to go exploring here? Oh? I don't think this is a good idea at all now. Not a good idea at all. Nope. actually starting to wonder whether I should do some research on this game because I am be playing so um, cautiously I'm not actually getting it done It is a little bit sad that you can't also explore the uh, atmosphere around this place. Because it does say it's like a... Uh, 
a sea and space exploration vehicle. Not that we actually get to explore space in this game, but then again, wouldn't that just be more terrifying as opposed to differently terrifying? Is beacon one. Okay, beacon two is actually closer. Right. Oh, that's a Reginald. Oh, hello, Reginald. Hello. Come with me, Reginald, if you want to live in the fish tank. The other thing I really need to figure out is how to charge this thing up again.
Yeah. That's what I was doing wrong. I just dropped them. I supposed to have actually used them. Welcome aboard, Captain. That'll explain it. Okay, and I'm out of water, so this, this is a great time to go back home. Reginald. Ah, hello. Hello, little fishies. Okay, so let's see. do it though. Let's go catch it so it's a couple of peepers and then I am I think I'm done for the day. That was uh, <clears throat> that was a lot. Yeah, I definitely can say not a massive fan of um, that Leviathan. Did not enjoy my uh, close encounter at all. Thank you. Um, Hmm? 
Yeah, I was going for that. That's what I was doing. One, two, three, one, two. Discs, trash compactors. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna see what I can do. Bleach. Okay, cook the peeper. sure what that entirely achieves but uh... okay so we still haven't found the multi-purpose room Still don't have the ingredients for that. Battery charger we've got, locker we've got.
Uh... Right. I think I'm gonna call it there. Just because I... I suspect that anything more I want to do uh, is going to require quite some uh, quite an expedition. I do have an idea of where we need to go next, even though it doesn't exactly fill me with a lot of confidence. Um, I'm going to have to see. Um, how I actually go about it. Um, uh, uh, in containment, I still haven't found all the blueprints for that. Um, trash can, nuclear waste disposal, uh, yeah, waste log, fire suppression equipment and laser cutters may be, ex may be required. So I haven't found diamond yet. So I need to find diamond and then I can do that bit. Yeah, and I can't even search for it here. But yeah, that's where uh, that's. I think that's where I'm gonna leave it. Um, save, and then. Um, then I'm gonna call it a night. Um, hope, hope you, uh, hope you, your ears didn't fall off after all the profanity I unleashed when I saw the, uh, when I saw the, the, um, Leviathan. Um, yikes. Uh, but yeah, in the meantime, I think what I'm going to do so Ryan's going to be back tomorrow. He's going to be playing uh, some Warframe and some Hades, probably. Um, possibly Warframe and a little bit of Black Desert Online. But definitely Warframe. Um, and then I'm also back tomorrow. I'm playing from 3 to 6. I'm playing Morrowind. Uh, it's been going quite well. We have, we're going to probably have... We're going to, we we may or may not have a special guest tomorrow afternoon. Uh Heckler, who was on last week during my uh six to eight thirty stream. Uh she and I were talking up a storm about world creation and uh how you go about it and what, what our kind of goals are and what we kind of find interesting about it. Uh so that was a very interesting conversation. So we'll I'm I'm hoping that she can join us again tomorrow, and then we'll probably talk about some world building in Morrowind, because I found a really cool article about it, uh, or about the making of Morrowind that I have been reading the whole week, because uh, it's long, it's a long article, um, but also like the the thinking thinking back of when when at the time when it was being created and uh, where where I was and what I was doing. And I was completely unaware of Morrowind at the time, but if I had been playing Morrowind, I think it would have blown my mind. Um, when it came out, I think it would have blown my mind entirely. But yeah, so we're going to be playing Morrowind and chatting about the world building there uh, from 3 to 6. And then from 6 to 8.30, Ryan's going to be playing Warframe and Hades. Then on Saturday... He's actually doing an extra stream 
from about six o'clock again, uh, where he will be doing uh, definitely if he hasn't done it tomorrow, he'll be doing it on Saturday. Uh, but character creation in Black Desert Online, it's a really, really complicated, complex um, Uh, really complex uh, sort of system for character creation, very, very uh, clever. Um, so yeah, he's gonna be he's gonna be streaming that on Saturday. So yeah, hopefully you can join us. Um, in the meantime, I'm gonna play you out with our clip of the week, which is a short little video of him playing Warframe. So if you've never seen Warframe, or you don't know what the game is like. This is him playing uh, two Warframes called uh, Sevagoth and Nasia Prime. Nasia Prime used to be his main. Uh, Sevagoth is giving him a run for his money, though. No, it's not. It's not. It's Sevagoth and Wukong Prime, not Nasia Prime. But yeah, so here's the clip, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow.